so the subducting plate is visible, but then why is the mantle plume not visible? So what we see, um, and what most people I think would agree, is where you have subduction zones, where you have one plate sinking beneath the other, we get these very large planar blue sheet-like things going into the Earth's mantle. So most people would agree, okay, we're looking at a subducting plate. Mm -hmm. The issue is with mantle plumes. If we go to a hotspot, Hawaii or Iceland or anywhere like that, and we make a tomography map, you will get a big red blob at the surface. But then because of the uncertainties in seismology, basically it becomes debatable whether you have a plume there or not. You might see a red blob, but how deep does it go yeah. down? Yeah, but okay, so the, but the fact that subduction occurs is a fact, right? Yeah, that, yes. That's yeah, yeah. undenied. So the subducting plate is visible, but then why is the mantle plume not visible? 